Scratch a lie, find a thief. That's what Spirit said. Scratch a lie and find a thief. This day and age, you have to be very mindful and protective of your energy because people are out to take more than physical and financial things. People are out to steal energy, joy, time, resources, you know, resources that are not physical. So spirit wants you to be very mindful about upping your protection and, you know, listening with more than your two ears this season. Watch a person's actions. Um, you're going to, it's going to be a lot of fast talkers this Gemini season. But before I jump into that, hi, my name is Raji. I'm an evolved hustler and I am coming to you today with your collective reading for Monday. The moon is waxing gibbous in Libra. So we are definitely examining, balancing things out. We're examining justice, authority, and we are also examining relationships and partnerships and what we need to release so that we can move in a more like aligned situation. You know what I'm saying? Nobody got time for that this season. All right. So let's just get right into it. So, in the past, you know, there were some things that may have been revealed to you. We've got Leo energy. Like, there were some things that were revealed. Um, and sometimes rejection is God's protection. You feel me? You know, you may have decided that you would release. Um, it was revealed that you needed to release this John Horse in reverse, this Emperor in reverse energy. Um, this energy, Aries and Pisces and Leo here. It was um, shown to you that you needed to release this energy. You needed to recover and heal you know, so you had to let it go. This, um, you know, you had to step back into your power. This person was being very manipulative, Gemini energy, because they are low level, nine of coins in the reverse. They're low level and they weren't making any progress because of it, uh, because there is a lot of third party energy. This person utilizes their connections to have fortune. This person doesn't have any footing like on their own. They have to go through someone else. You feel me? This energy is being called to judgment, though, so no worries for their, their flaws um, that are, you know, affecting other people. Yeah, they made a decision that they're being called to judgment for. They decided to be with a queen of swords here, um, and so they did not move forward. And now, according to that, they're facing judgment for that Libra energy. Yeah, they're very complacent. Like, a lot of people are very just, they sit happily in their BS, and they don't mind. They don't mind sitting in their misery, and spirit is saying, continue to let them. Yeah, somebody's being called a judgment for playing games. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because that's no longer a mystery. They play games, and they were in inspired so yeah this person they they didn't adapt they they didn't want to adapt so they like you guys could collaborate you know they just kind of stay where they are and the reason they can't collaborate is because they can't provide they're relying on somebody else's energy and they are at peace being stupid like wisdom in reverse they're at peace being stupid so they just sitting in their shit and spirit said let them <laughs> Spirit said, let them, let them sit there, let them sit in it. Yeah, then they, they haven't talked because, again, these two energies are miserable together. There's a ten of coins in the reverse. Um, There's a five of sticks. Yeah, so somebody's not feeling ambitious to, like, set down roots, make a change, to take a leap of faith. This particular person, uh, yeah, they were maybe wanting to take a leap towards a mother of coins here, but it looks like, mm, there was a bit of bullshit that needs to happen. Yeah, this mother of coins now is healing from this betrayal. Like, this person is choosy. Um, yeah, the betrayal has to be stopped. So, mm -mm. there was a person here. They betrayed this, this family unit. They betrayed this mother of coins. And something has been put to a halt. Yeah, this person was moving very reckless. And now they're trying to find their way out of this predicament. But, mm too little too late because they've been you know yeah what they say your slip is showing now presently yeah this person is like trying to decide what type of move they're gonna make 
because they have hidden something. They've hidden that they were not, you know, there was an incompatibility here. Maybe they weren't as committed as they should be. And it's something that they they committed to. They've committed to dysfunction, basically. There's a lot of fighting and a lot of, like, battling going on right now because someone could not release uh, third-party energies. They weren't able to extend any type of offers. Yeah, and so they were really trying to... They were working very hard here, working very hard to keep this, keep this energy going, keep that, that, what do they call it? I can't, I, I could have come back to me what they call it, triangulation, you feel me? Yeah, somebody is um, not consumed um, with being strong and being courageous. This particular person, their intentions, you know, they have bad instincts, they, they don't, they don't have good intentions. Yeah, because they are trying to play games. They're trying to be smart. They're trying to be cunning. They're not trying to have a rebirth here. They're not trying to transform because they don't believe in themselves. They have no confidence in themselves. And it's a lot that this person is hiding um, that they're going to have to overcome. <clears throat> they're worried. They're worried about their progress. They're worried about uh, these partnerships that they've entangled themselves in that aren't, you know, bringing them what they thought that it was going to bring presently though the collective so yeah this 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 relationship this partnership this decision was made um to you know this person was lying someone in your energy gemini is being deceitful um about the loss the ending of something because they are a liar okay they are a liar. They are a deceiver, baby. Yeah, and spirit wants you to keep moving forward, you know, keep moving forward. But you can, because this this is not going to be a long-term team. They they can't offer you anything because, yeah, this you, you need to try to avoid this tower. Avoid it. Keep going. Avoid this tower. Avoid the betrayal. You know what I'm saying? See shit for what it really is. This person is being revealed to you, so pay attention to what you see. Pay attention, honey. Pay attention. This person is in a lot of third-party collaborations. They they don't know what they want to do. They being manipulative. They dealing with an empress in reverse and several others. Yeah, somebody, you know, they, they don't want to work hard. They don't want to take this leap of faith because, again, they dealing with somebody manipulative. They dealing with somebody just like them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They feeling regretful, though. They are in remorse because now they want to try to come towards you and offer this stability to this high priestess. But, you know, again, make a movement. But then you got these other third-party energies standing in the way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this person did something bad towards the collective. And they were very much emotionally manipulative about it. Um, and Spirit wants you to release this burden. Release the burden of this problem because this is this person's problem that they can't come forward with this offer, not yours. You know, this King of Wands is very controlling, very manipulative, trying to control the outcome of things. You feel me? You know, Spirit wants you to continue to lay this situation to rest. You know, this person, you may even be lacking patience with this person, so you decided to forget it. Yeah, it needs to be balance restored, and it's only being restored by ending this because this person has too many secrets. This, this is a coupe, right? Coupe de gras, period. Yeah, this person is conniving. This person is deceitful, you know, trying to head a cake and eat it too on all levels. In the near future, though, you can expect to overcome these challenges. Somebody is going to try to come in and make amends, quite likely. Um, again, um... Mm, again though but spirit's saying like plain day like avoid this tower you know what i'm saying don't don't fall into this commitment with this person release this back release this energy release that burden this person has a lot going on and they still gotta work out within themselves truth 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 baby i had to run the dick yo this person is not able to offer any long-term plans. They can't. They can't give an offer. They can't. They haven't healed because... So, you're basically going to be able to avoid this tower with this um, energy because this person is not... Like, they're not official. This Bishop C.H. Mason is not doing the right thing. They have 10 sticks in reverse. They are very much weighed down with baggage, extra entities, you know, attachments. That There is a lot of exposure happening in their lives. Things that they need to 
control, you know, get it together. Um, the truth of the matter is though that there is not an there was not an offer being extended to heal the situation because the person uh was having a hard time walking away uh from this from juggling something. Yeah, they were very much juggling the situation. But we got a page of swords here thinking, um, uh, let's see, someone was thinking, um, Hmm, we got this here. What is this? Seven of uh, swords. Yeah, somebody in reverse. Somebody was having a hard time walking away from this um, Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, because maybe they weren't going to be able to get some assistance. Maybe they weren't going to be able to get some help. So this is why we have this um, situation. So I was trying to stop someone from offering uh, assistance and help to start a new situation. They wanted that person destabilized, you feel me? So this Queen of Swords um, is very much holding on. Is she a Queen of Swords? Hold on, y'all. Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, she's very much holding on to something, refusing to let go. Yeah, not wanting to be left out in the cold. Wanting someone to return. Didn't, oh, someone didn't want someone to return to this Queen of uh, Wands in the upright. Yeah, didn't want them to return. So they was really trying to control the situation here. This person got a lot of attachments. Yeah, this person is trying to control this King of Pentacles uh, in the up right here. Yeah. Maybe there's a lot of deception being revealed. Yeah. In regards to a commitment. Yeah. So somebody was trying to be very courageous. They were trying to be fearless in the way that they were going to make a move and release this attachment. Or they need to be need to be strong, move forward, release this attachment. We have the Ace of Swords here. I feel like spirit is just like letting it be known that there needs to be some type of balance. This person is juggling though. Yeah, someone's very much fighting. <laughs> fighting to protect something. Yeah, this uh mother of Steve. This mother of Steve is fighting to protect something. She is trying to protect her ego. Mm-hmm. Yeah, not wanting to be juggled. Not wanting to have things balanced. That's her goal. Or your goal. Yeah. Someone's goal. Yeah. Somebody doesn't want to be juggled with this this Empress here. So yeah, this Empress energy, this person, they like they might not even want to juggle you at the end of the day, but they're just trying to be controlling. They want to control everything. This father speaks in reverse, wants to control everything. So he's trying to hold on. He's trying to formulate a plan to stop this cycle from ending. Mm. Yeah, this person doesn't want this cycle to end. But guess what? Judgment's being called regardless of the fact. Because they need to face what they've done in the past. Mm -hmm. When they invested in a partnership, they wasn't like, you know, they did it for the wrong reasons. They weren't loyal. They weren't committed. They are committed to anything long term, honestly. Spirit wants you to guard your boundaries against this energy. Mm -hmm. Because they will of fortune is in reverse of yours. We will be, you know, because they want to provide confusion. They up under the illusion of something. Yeah. But mother of knives, yeah, somebody playing mind games and trying to stop the progress of something. Goals. Not able to work hard or something. Yeah, they want to stop somebody from like deciding they're gonna leave. Honestly, <laughs> they trying to stop it. Yeah, they trying to stop somebody. They very passionate about stopping somebody from leaving. But spirit wants you to focus on you. Yeah, cause these these people trying to send you into a tizzy. Cause we got a mother of baskets energy here. Yeah, spirit wants you to walk away from shit. Like, don't be overly emotional about these. Yeah. This mother of baskets is definitely a con artist, though. She's emotionally manipulative as hell. And she's very stubborn. <laughs> this person is stubborn about ending this partnership. You know what I'm saying? Strong energy. Yeah. So, you need to be the direct opposite. In the live podcast, that the, the energy was... You know, be strong. Don't be delusional. Don't don't be. You need to be the direct opposite of what this other energy is. That's your guidance. You know, during this season, don't be delusional. Don't let nobody play in your face. If this person, other woman, want to be delusional, this other feminine energy you want to play, let them play. You don't play that though, homie. Don't play that. <laughs> so overall, at the end of the day, you know, spirit is saying this was a risky gamble. You know what I'm saying? 
They're just saying this is a risky gamble. There is a, a need to control, you feel what I'm saying, with the Capricorn energy in your spirit wants you to, you know, make the decision to release this. Yep. Because this father is seeing this in reverse. This person is in balance, you know, because again, they trying to they, they focus on prosperity, they focus on gain, and you need to the material gain, and that's just not how you doing. You know, obviously you're focused on yourself, but you, you need to not make this decision based off material gain. You need to make this off of respect, boundaries. You know, this is some long-term shit. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Somebody's very, like, indecisive. It's the Gemini energy. Yeah, they're very indecisive about extending an offer. A long-term offer. Yeah. And then, you know, so they, like, kind of stepped into manipulation almost. Let me see something. Yeah, so they manipulate several energies all at once. What I say, there's a lot of third-party energies that you don't know about. They trying to hide it. They trying to hide the fact that they're extending offers to a lot of people. Um, but it's being revealed at this point. They've been exposed. They've been exposed. This this Queen of Um Cups here, this Queen of Cups energy is because that person has been exposed. This person is no longer considering working on these. They they've decided to let this situation go with this higher fun in reverse. Uh, because this person is being slow. This person is like being all over the place about coming forth with an offer. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they being all over the place about coming forth with an offer because they are, you know, focused on the material gain through lovers, like many lovers. <laughs> many lovers, okay? Um, collecting them. So yeah, this this person, you know, is very worried and trapped up in their mind about what yeah, about money. They just trying to make sure they, they got they they straight. That's all they care about. That's all they worried about. So they willing to fight for this. They willing to go to bed. They doing all that they can do. So they're stuck. You know? They're stuck. They're stuck on something. What are they stuck on? Yeah, they stuck in lack of confidence because they focused on the wrong shit. Yeah, they not confident. They can't offer anything to anybody. Everything's in balance. They got too many energies in their energy. Yeah. There's a death here. Mm -hmm. Spirit is like someone is not able to make peace with the pain. Spirit wants that to be shifted, though. Um, maybe someone strategizing an ending, strategizing a rebirth. This person wants that cake and eat it, too. Yeah. Somebody needs to walk away from being stubborn, you know, not getting a grip. This, this father of baskets. This father of baskets is not offering anything to anyone because... They're a liar. <laughs> yeah, they lie, man. This person is a deceiver. They're very, like, deceptive about their finances. They're deceptive about giving offers. They just playing games with everybody right now. And it's an injustice. It's an injustice. This, this father of coins is, like, playing. Like, the father knives, manipulation, bro. Bad. Yeah, that's what they hold. They they hide that they very manipulatable when they get ready to go into new partnerships and new things. Mm -hmm. Stubborn. It's crazy. This person is hiding themselves, ultimately. And Spirit wants you to connect. So you've got this energy that is consistently disguising themselves, uh, but they're being revealed no matter what. You know what I'm saying? So they're no longer able to go hunt people. You know, they are being revealed for who, exactly who they are. Yeah, they try to come across like they want to create this kind, happy situation, but they're unable to create anything sacred because at the end of the day, they're not free. You know what I'm saying? They haven't grown. You me? They still, they still trying to trick people and they're still being revealed. It's like they ain't catch a clue. But this person does want you to trust them. You know, they want to come forth with the courage to make a deal, but they don't love themselves. You know what I'm saying? So how can they love you? There's a lot of healing that needs to be done before this person can truly like care. Lots of healing. Lots of healing needs to be done. I ran the day because it's Gemini season and the tea was just too good to pass up. But that's my word, y'all. Um, I'm definitely um wanting you guys to know that spirit just wants you to focus on yourself, focus on your own growth, focus on what you got going on. You know, 
understanding. When people show you who they are, believe them the first time. Don't don't, don't have to be told over and over what energies are because people will continue to play and siphon your energy and, you know, not make a decision. No decision is a decision at the end of the day. If you would like an intentions reading or a full reading for Gemini season, hit me up. I'll be more than happy to assist, you know, because people, mind games, mind games, mind games. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, the cards, you know, they do a lot of shit, but they damn sure don't lie. It's about the possibility of the thing, but they don't lie. So, I love you guys. Thank you so much for following, liking, sharing, and subscribing. And, yeah, tell a friend, tell a friend. We'll chat soon.